Who is this? Morning. Morning, Mr. Ears. How you doing? How you doing? Looking mighty fine. Looking kind of like a shadow from that angle. There you go. There you are. How you doing, bud? Good boy. You know that? You are a good boy. You can pick up satellite radio with those things. You know that? How about you? <laughs> you just t tune off his frequency, don't you? Morning. We're here in Toledo. Oh, 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 we got another member coming up on here. Come on, get up here. I'm not going to help you. You can do it by yourself. Come on, get up here. Fine, I'll help you. Come on, get up here. Come on, you got to do... Okay, I can... There, oh, there you go. Oh, oh, my. Okay. Okay, here we are. Here we are. The whole family. We're here. What do you want? You just wanted to be close to me? Oh. You just wanted to be close to me? You're a good boy. Yep. Now you're going to gaze into my eyes? That's weird. So we are having a nice relaxing morning here. Oh, well, we were until this little guy decided to step on me. Oh, you were getting big already, man. He's getting big. He's like over half the size of Diesel already. <laughs> and you still wet the bed, man. His bed, not mine. I don't trust him for long periods of time on my bed until he can't, or until he proves to me that uh, he won't wet his bed anymore. <laughs> just sometimes, right? Just sometimes. Am I embarrassing you? I'm sorry. All the ladies still love you, don't worry. Eh, who could not love that face and those ears? You're lucky, man. I wish I had that effect. You don't even have to say anything. All the girls love you right away. <laughs> yeah, so we're gonna be traveling up into uh, up to Sarnia, Ontario. Welcome to Sarnia. It's like Narnia, but with an S. Sarnia. That's what they called it. I don't know which came first. I don't know if there's a wardrobe in Sarnia that leads to a magical place. I don't know. But we're gonna go there for tonight, or for today, whatever. It's like two and a half hours away, so that's why I'm not in any big rush. I'm sort of just sitting back here with the boys. Diesel's just relaxing here in the sunlight, getting his tan on. Good boy. And I think we're gonna get going right away, guys. Uh, not much to tell you other than that. It's gonna be a short day. We're gonna get there, maybe go for a nice walk. And hang out there till the morning, and we gotta deliver one of eight drops tomorrow morning. Yeah, it's going to be a lot of drops on this load, so it's one of those again. Uh, we're starting in Ontario. I think we got something like six in Ontario, leading up to around the Ottawa area. area. And then we go into Quebec. So, everybody brush up on your French, because this next week, we're going to be going into Quebec. Well, we're going through Detroit. I don't know if you can see it up above there. There's a helicopter. I believe that's the police chopper, I think. Maybe it's a news chopper. It looks like a cop chopper. Make me nervous when the police helicopters are flying circles around me. What do you want? Touch down to I-96. I'm innocent. I didn't do it. What did she say now? Keep right? Keep right. Okay, yeah. I don't want to... No, you keep, why are you telling me to keep right? But well, you're showing me to go straight. This is confusing. So welcome to Detroit. We're uh, just across the river from Canada, but we're going up to a different... Uh, Border crossing, like I was telling you before, uh, Port here on Michigan. We're going to cross into in Sarnia, Ontario. Take exit 198 on right to I 94 West, then keep right. Oh, great, of course, it's all busy traffic here right now. Thanks, Detroit. Thank you. I need to get over to the right there, good people. Excuse me, I have my signal device working. I can see it in my mirror, it's working. That seems to signal drivers and cars to step on the gas and get beside you real quick because they don't want to be behind you. One more lane, one more lane towards Port Huron. Take exit 198 on right to I-94 West, then, then keep, keep right. right. Yes! 
We finish each other's sentences, Mandy. Port Huron, here we go, Port Huron. That's the one. Keep right on to I-94 East. 30 mile per hour or you might tip. Slow her down, Trucker Josh, slow her down. You don't want to fall over. The truck does not work well on its side. Just spits you right out into traffic. Now give her. In 1.5 kilometers, keep left on I-94, then keep right. Oh, this is confusing. Oh, all right, all right, all right, moving over, moving over. All right, here we go. People were trying to merge in. All right, so we're getting to the bridge where we cross into Canada. First, we got to pay for the bridge. They want our money. Because at Sarnia here, you still have to pay. Uh, when you cross from Detroit into Windsor, there it just gets billed to the registered owner of the vehicle, right? By license plate. I'm pretty sure they're gonna change this to the same system soon, but I don't really know. All right, everybody wants to wait in that one, I'm gonna go in this one. We got people stopped here. Why do they got customs over here? Strange, they must be looking for somebody. You gonna pick up the hockey game with those ears? I know you can pick up all kinds of stuff with that, man. Two little satellites on your head there. That sun is really, really bright. Like, really bright. It's right in my face. You probably shouldn't look directly at the sun, guys. Stop looking at the sun. Bad for your eyes. We're at this Flying J, which is actually an ESSO. So strange, because the pumps, as you can see here, are Flying J, right? But the business, as you can see back there, is an ESSO. So what? And the building there, that's all an ESSO. They got a Burger King in there and whatnot. And... Is it an ESSO or is it a Flying J? Make up your mind. I don't know. I know you can get Flying J fuel here, but you can't use your points for showers here, apparently, or something. I don't know. Good thing I showered last night. I'd like to shower again tonight. It's I like to have that habit of showering every day. You know, it's nice to be in that habit. <laughs> what are you looking at? 
You've only had like one or two baths in your life, you dirty boy. You're a dirty boy. Diesel, are you comfortable back there or what? Look at him, he's got a pillow all propped up against the window and everything. He's like, yeah, this is life, man. I'm here, man. I'm here on the bed, man. I'm nice and comfortable. Oh, so good. <laughs> so this has sort of become Sergeant's little area here, and that's Diesel's area. We were just outside. There's so much room back here. I don't know if you'll be able to see it or not, but all of that room back there is like a huge open field, right? Oh, they just had a blast running around there. I'd love to be able to vlog them running around every time, but when I'm in areas like this and I don't trust them to be loose, I actually have to hold on to their leashes, right? This steering wheel is creaky. Anyways, that was distracting me. Hey, look, a squirrel. I get distracted easy. What was I saying? Yeah, I don't uh, trust them to be loose here, right? Because I don't know this place. I've never been here before. I thought that it was an actual flying J, not an actual flying J. It's uh, SO slash flying J. But, so I have to hold on to them, right? And it takes two hands to control these guys because they just go nuts in a good way. Like they wrestle and play and roll around and get tangled up in their leashes and then I got to get them untangled and then they go running around again and get retangled. And it's just a constant, constant, constant battle make sure that they don't like strangle themselves or something you know <laughs> they'll run around each other with the leashes but I want to let them wrestle I don't want to let them run around outside so usually what I'll get them to do is a uh, sergeant chases diesel right because diesel doesn't want anything to do with sergeant really he's like that big brother and uh, he his little brother's not cool enough you know so sergeant obviously he's a little brother and he looks up to diesel you are his hero diesel do you know that you are his hero I don't care, man. He's annoying. He's, he's annoying. He's barking. He bites me all the time, man. He chases me. He's a puppy. He's going to do that. Look at him. <laughs> you look really comfortable. So anyway, so I get sergeant chasing diesel right so to get sergeant running I got to get diesel running so I get diesel running in a circle around me then all I can do all I got to do is sit in the same spot and spin and then diesel at the end of his leash just torques around me in circles as fast as he can right and sergeant follows him so then we do that until they can't run anymore <laughs> that's what we do when I can't let them off leash I got to get their energy out and got to let them run and exercise right because they got to build those muscles that's what we do it's better if you let them off the leash to run but some people don't like it when you take your dogs off leash. Not everybody's a dog person. I don't know how you couldn't be a dog person. Like dogs are awesome. Animals in general, I like animals. Cats are okay. I like being the boss though. Cats, they think they're the boss. Nuh uh, not in my house. I'm the boss. Dogs you can train and whatnot, and I don't know, dogs just have so many human characteristics and qualities, you know, that I just... Hmm. You remember that big garbage bin that I bought? I have it here. Let's see if I can show you this. Oh. Alright, are you ready for this? It's like... Right here. We play Jets! I know, we got bumped out of the playoffs already, but hey, we won! Or we got into the playoffs. We didn't win the Stanley Cup, but we got into the playoffs, which is almost like winning the Stanley Cup. That's almost as exciting as if the Maple Leafs made it into the playoffs, eh? <laughs> I better be careful. I'm in Ontario. There's Leaf fans everywhere. You know my uh, roommate, John, his brother, uh, plays in the NHL. Did you know that? He used to play on the Toronto Maple Leafs. Uh, oh, where did he all play? Maple Leafs, Ian White, anyways, is his name, right? And uh, yeah, that's my roommate's brother, NHL guy. There's my connection to the NHL. Absolutely. Anything else to add, Sergeant? Anything at all? Nothing? All right.
Are you guys done making out in the corner back there? So that's the day guys. I'm um, just sitting here editing it up. Look at that guy right there. Look at that guy looking cool with his shades. Who does he think he is? Wearing his shades like he thinks he's cool. Whatever. Uh, for supper today, I want to show you this. I made pulled pork sandwich. I got these big soft fresh buns. And uh, this I bought at Walmart. It's actually, well, it's pre-made, but now you just have to heat it up, you know, whatever. It's probably not the most healthiest thing in the entire world, but it is in the top 10 of the most delicious things in the entire world. Wow, really good. But I'll see you guys tomorrow, anytime after 4 a.m. Central Time. Don't forget to go to the YouTube page, find me, Trucker Josh Vlogs. Subscribe to me there so that you don't miss a single day. Follow me on Facebook and Twitter. You can just Google me, Google Trucker Josh. You'll find all my stuff right there. That way, all my stuff will be sent to directly to you. Don't forget to friend me if you just like my uh, fan page. The videos don't get sent to that page, but uh, you can just go to my personal page there. And you'll find it. You guys are smart. Why am I in the dark? Oh, this is a terrible ending. There's the light over there. Go to the light. I'll see you tomorrow, guys.